let me take care of you here. You're muted right now. You are unmuted, Mr. Malara. Tell everybody right. what you do, how you do. I'm dying to hear your presentation. Your five minutes starts right now. Okay, great. Can, can you hear me, Claude? We can hear you. The Perfect. Whole world, the whole world can hear you. This is the <laughs> The whole world. All right, so first of all, I want to say, uh, well, I'm Hugo Malara. I want to say I'm very grateful to be here, to be part of this group. I learned a lot from you guys, definitely from you, Claude, uh, Audrey, Felipe, Mr. Cashoffer. I forget the, the, the couple of realtors, uh, that there are a couple. I learned a lot from you guys. And the reason sometimes I'm not here is because I'm a high school teacher, so I'm teaching at that moment when this is going on. But I, I always listen to you guys. Uh, and guts, the gut sales system has definitely changed my life. That's what I wanted to share with you guys. Um, I'm originally from El Salvador. I was born there, grew up, and came to the United States back in 1994 when I was around almost 12. Um, I didn't know English. I didn't know the land. Uh, didn't know English. I didn't know the the country. All I knew was the United States is the land of opportunity, and it is. My parents taught me that all you need is to work hard, uh, but what they missed was you need to work smart as well, you know? So we got the hard part going. So I managed to, you know, I wasn't the greatest student, but I managed to go to college. Uh, I worked at different jobs, and then I ended up be, becoming a teacher. But it was kind of like a love-hate relationship because as a teacher, I just didn't have the respect of the students. I didn't have respect from uh, my other colleagues. And I felt also that my personal relationships, you know, I just wasn't a great communicator. So um, one thing I did have was that I, I tend to care for people, right? So uh, I felt that, you know what? If I have money, if I make a lot of money, then people will respect me. People would um, appreciate me more, stuff like that. My wife would like me more. <laughs> Right, so that's when I started looking forward to see um, how can I make more money, right? Oh, real estate, right? I worked with a, with a guru for about a year. Nothing happened because even though I, got a, I learned a lot about lease options, subject twos, uh, there, was, there was no sales. There were no sales techniques in that, right? So then I decided to go back because I took a year off <clears throat> from being a teacher. Uh, I went back to uh, teach again, and I was thinking, well, you know, I love the kids, but oh, it's going to be hard. I'm going to be abused, you know, by, by everybody. And then I found uh, on YouTube a clip by Joe McCall, right? And there was this guy named Claude Diamond. And I love how he – I'm like, whoa, this guy was – I, I, I kind of like how he, how he speaks. So I gave him a call because I really wanted to see if he actually picked up his phone, and he did. He was actually on a run. <laughs> when I when I uh, uh, I talked to him, well, long story short, because I don't want to make it too long, <clears throat> I started yep, working with minutes. him. I started working with him uh, with the hopes that I was gonna make a lot of money, feel good about myself, and then leave my job. But the funny thing that happened was that the more I learned about guts, I started using it in my personal life and in the classroom. I started using qualifications. Uh, redirection, stroking, nurturing, uh, commitments, and the magic that happened was that I got compliance from students. S student, I became the go-to person for uh, my colleagues, you know, if they needed something, they needed advice. I got a lot of appreciation. Some of my students say, oh, Mr. Malara, you're my favorite teacher now. I asked them wow. why. They're like, <laughs> I asked them why, because you listen to us. You don't judge us, you know. And some of the students who were like, oh, I don't care about my academics. Now they do care. Some of the parents call me because they need help with their children. And uh, I just, I'm just sincere with them. I ask them questions. Uh, mostly listening. That's what I'm doing. I sold my wife, used guts to sell my wife on the idea of having a baby. Right? And <laughs> my, to let them know, okay, we're not financially there yet, but we will someday. My baby boy is uh, a month and a half right now. It's great. Um, so basically what I wanted to say is that I thought I wanted money to get love, appreciation. That's high self-esteem. I got that before I got the money. So now, basically, definitely I'm looking for financial freedom, but I got emotional freedom now. I don't have to worry about how I feel now, and now I can focus on my wife, my kid, 
my other kids who are my students. Um, and so I just want to say, God has definitely changed my life. So the question is, why should you vote for me? Um, no, maybe you shouldn't. But if you don't, you will have regrets. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I just want to say I'm very grateful for, for this. And, uh, you know, uh, thank you, Claude, for everything. Well, thank you. What a good presentation. Very wonderful. Give him a round there. I, I want to do a disclaimer. Guts should not be used as a gut as a birth control device. Uh, by the way. <laughs> right. <laughs> Absolutely wonderful presentation, and you should have uh, you should have uh, just a little. Uh, I love your presentation. I love talking about kids and teaching and your new baby. You should have used some pictures in your presentation, maybe for next. Oh, week. oh definitely yes. A little visual that uh, that how your uh, how you've developed has in, has changed the life of those children and everything. A teacher is a very important profession in our world today. Very important, very good, good presentation, and you made it, and you cracked me up a little there. Uh, very good. Um, who Who is next? Who hasn't gone yet? Huh? There we go. Hey.